Seven Things to Avoid in a Potential Influencer Campaign A guide is never complete if you don't warn of the mistakes that are commonly made, even though they are easily avoidable. Here are seven of them you should absolutely run from. 1. Not defining campaign goals and KPIs If you don't define the goals clearly, you don't know what to compare the end results with. This rule applies to every kind of marketing, and the influencer market is no exception. In fact, this branch of marketing is a lot more organic and has room for a lot of creativity. But the basics must be in place so that the success of the creative experiments can also be measured. 2. Choosing unvetted influencers When planning a campaign with an influencer, this is one of the first mistakes many brands make. You want to pick someone in your niche. But that's not the only factor, as we saw in the previous chapter. Picking a popular name from your niche is lazy work. You want someone who has an original voice that is a good fit for your brand. They must agree with your core values and hopefully like your vision and believe in your product too. You are essentially picking a brand ambassador. You want someone with a good track record and reputation in the industry. Why? Because you don't want your influencer to go rogue on you during or after the campaign. 3. Cold Outreach Contacting individuals you don't know is a process called cold calling. This practice has been around for a long time and is still actively used. This is the first step for many marketers, even when it comes to finding influencers. If you're one of those, bad news. This doesn't always fetch you the results you're hoping for. 4. Bad Contracts If you want to protect your brand from a failed influencer marketing campaign, Draw an efficient contract. This is a document that has a record of all the things both parties agreed to. 5. Cheap promotion. Don't try to get more for less. This is not a case where offering inadequate compensation has any chance of a win for you. The only scenario where this might possibly work is if the brand is established and well-recognized, but the influencer isn't. And in those cases, the collaboration is more likely to fail than succeed. 6. Stifling their creativity Don't tell your influencer what kind of content must be created. That's their area of expertise. Plus, if it comes from your team, you might as well place a traditional ad. The idea behind using an influencer is to use their voice, which resonates with their followers. It keeps them authentic, which continues to maintain the trust they have with their audience. Trust that will transfer to your brand if you just let them do their thing. Seven. Neglecting Video Content Every branch of digital marketing must include a budget for video marketing. This is particularly applicable if you have a limited budget. Making videos is not always a cheap affair, and you must remember that original content is a lot better than curated stuff. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.